right, so we're starting back up the box break. Hey, what's up, Harold? Um, we have some personals, but I want to really finish, focus on finishing this box break. Uh, we had a technical problem. This is going to be part two of the video. Uh, we did the random already. I'm going to fast forward to right um, to the point where we left off. And you can absolutely see I have not moved anything or touched anything. There, there, this is the old video. And now look, you can see exactly everything is placed when I minimize this. And it just goes to show, I mean, I have not moved a single thing. Oh, wait a minute. What I'm trying to do is go seamless from that spot in the old video to this. So you can just see how it's like flawlessly... Like, it would be impossible for me to have moved anything. So I want to do that real quick, and then we'll go right back to the, to the break. Okay, so I'm trying to do that right now. Okay, so you can see when I flip to the old video... I mean, it is, if I, if I did some moving of anything, it would be like magic. <laughs> Seriously, because that's the old video. That's what's live. Okay, so if I, if I somehow move, manage to move something, it, it would be just incredible that I was able to place everything back the way that it was. The camera has not moved. There's been nothing that's moved. So I just want to make that point and just reassure you that, that uh, even though we had that technical problem and we're making a part two of the video that, you know, I'm flashing from the old video. You can rewind this. And look, we pull these two out. That's where the video ended. Zero, zero, zero. And now this is the live version right here. You're looking at the live version now. And uh, so that's, let's pick things up back where we left off. Um, I have, like I said, it's been a technical issue, so I have to kind of like uh, screen share or figure out a way. I'm going to see if this works. Okay. It's kind of weird, but it's, it's going to work. As long as you can see who has what team right here. Uh, I know there's some white print down there, but it's the only way I can recover this sheet without actually having to sit here and type it in, laboriously type it in. I can kind of show you this, this segment of the screen on the live feed, if you get what I'm saying. So and it's pretty readable. And it should work. So anyway, all right, picking things back up where we left off. Here we go. Let's get back to the break. And we finished off. Okay, so Montreal. I'm not going to be able to highlight this or really do anything with this list. But you can see Adam B. has Montreal. Congratulations, Adam. All right, so let's get these out of here and we'll get rid of this box. And we'll see what else is coming out of the break. So Adam pulls this one down. Hope. And the next hit out of the box break. Oh my, look at this thing. Hope. Oh, nasty hit right here. Oh, would you look at that? It's a one of five. Oh, my gosh. Montreal. Big hits coming out. Congratulations to the Montreal Canadiens owner. Dual scripted sticks hits. Nasty. Wow. 
Wow. That is really nasty. Next up in the break, it looks to be a San Jose hit for Luke. Triple Relics. Cup Trios, 4 of 33. Luke L., congratulations, Luke. Nice hit. And for our final hit of the box break, good luck, everyone. The final hit out of here is going to be a Islanders. New York Islanders for Richard M. Congratulations, Richard. With your Noah Dobson. Nice rookie. So that's pretty cool. Way to go, man. That is the cup hockey. And that is our part two of the box break.